Getting started with Blockly for Pickaxe. To start programming Pickaxe chips with the Blockly system, you will need either the Pickaxe Editor 6 software, which is for Windows only, or you can use the Blockly for Pickaxe app, which is run within the Chrome web browser, or you can use the Pickaxe Cloud version at www.pickaxecloud.com. You will also need the Axe 27 cable and driver installed on your computer. You can download the software for free from the Pickaxe website. There is also dedicated technical support in the Pickaxe forum pages. Connect power and the Axe 27 cable to your project board and here we're using the Axe 130 with an 08M2 chip. In the Windows version, shown here, you can navigate to the editor from your start menu. If using the app version in the Chrome web browser, select Apps and then select the Blockly app. This shows the initial setup procedure if using the Pickaxe Editor 6 or the Chrome app versions. Select the correct chip, in this case an 08M2. Select the correct COM port. This is set up when you install the Axe 27 cable for the first time. In the Windows version, select the 08M2 simulator. And in the Chrome app version, make sure Show Simulator is checked in the settings menu. From here on, the Windows version, the Chrome app version and the cloud-based version all work exactly the same. In this tutorial, we'll show you how you can program an output device, in this case, an LED. Right-clicking on a block will show more options. Here, I am duplicating a block. In the Windows version, select the Simulate tab so you can operate the Run and Stop buttons. See how each stage is highlighted as the simulator cycles through the program. In the Windows version, the Program button is found on the Home tab. And by pressing Program, your code will be uploaded to the chip on your project board. A status indicator is shown in the bottom right hand corner. In the Chrome app version, the status indicator is at the top of the screen. And remember, you can always get technical support and advice from the forum pages on www.pickaxe.com. Next time, we'll show you how to program an input device.